Hello guys, myself Amrita. Welcome back to our channel TechnoSage. So in today's video, we are going to discuss leap code problem number 58, that is length of last word. So let's get started. Given a string s consisting of words and spaces, return the length of last word in a string. A word is a maximal substring consisting of non-space characters only. So in the example, you can see we have an input string that is hello world. And we need to return the length of last word in this string. So in this string, last word is world and the length of world is 5. So output should be 5. So in the second example, you can see the input string is fly me to the moon. And the output is 4 because in this string, last word is moon which is having length 4. So we need to find the length of last word in a string. In this particular input, we have spaces. So we need to first remove these spaces to find the length of the last word. So let's first understand the approach, then we'll write a solution for it. So let's say we are taking the input string as fly to the moon. And after moon also we have some space and before fly also we have some space. Length of last word that is moon and length of moon is 4. So the output should be 4. So what we are going to do? First we are going to remove the extra spaces from here. So after removing the extra spaces using prim function, the string becomes fly to the moon. There are no extra spaces before fly and after moon. So now what we are going to do? We are going to run a reverse loop from the last character and we are going to count the characters for the last word. So let's say we started counting the characters from n. So 1, 2, 3, 4. Once we found the space, we need to break the loop. So that means our condition should be we need to keep counting the characters. Let's say if we are taking the counter as 0 and we started the loop from the n character. So count becomes 1. Then O character count becomes 2, 3 and when character is M count becomes 4. And once we found the space, we need to break the loop. This is how we need to solve this problem. So let's write a solution for it now. This is our class length of last word and we are going to write a method static int since we are going to return the integer as the output and length of last word. And it will take the input as one string. We can say S. So first what we are going to do, first we need to trim the string so as to remove the leading and the trailing spaces. So we can say string str s dot trim. So trim will remove the leading and the trailing spaces. And after that we can simply initialize the count as 0. And then let's run the loop which will start from the length of string minus 1 i greater than equals to 0 i minus minus since it is a reverse loop. And then we are going to check whether the character is a space. So if str.caret i is not equal to space, then only we are going to increase the counter. And if we found space, then we need to break the loop. That's it. At the end, we can return count, which is basically the length of last word in the string. Now let's call our method length of last word and take the string as fly to the moon and after moon we had some spaces length of last word str let's write our print statement to see the output let's run the program and see the output you can see here the count is 4 because last word was moon and length of moon is 4 let's test it with other examples as well so the first one was hello world so in hello world last word is world which is having length 5 so it should return 5 let's run the program and see the output so we can see here the output is Fine. So this is how we need to solve this problem. I hope you understood the solution. If you have any questions, any doubts, please let me know in the comment section. So don't forget to like, share and subscribe our channel and also press the bell icon to get the notifications. And in the upcoming videos, we will also solve some more lead code problems. Thank you so much for watching.